The universe is vast and full of mysteries. It stretches further than our minds can easily imagine. For all of human history, we have looked up at the night sky and wondered, what is out there? Are we alone? Every so often, the cosmos sends us a message. It sends a clue in the form of a faint light or a new object moving through our cosmic neighborhood. These moments are incredibly exciting. They are like finding a new piece of a giant puzzle. We get a little closer to understanding the grand story of everything. What is this incredible machine that took the picture? It is called the James Webb Space Telescope, or JWST for short. Think of it as a giant, powerful eye that we have sent into space. It is a time machine, because light takes time to travel across the universe. When Webb looks at distant objects, it sees them as they were in the past. It can see light that is very old from the beginning of the universe. This helps us understand how the first stars and galaxies were born. It is one of the most amazing things humans have ever built. The telescope has a huge mirror made of 18 golden hexagons. Gold is used because it is very good at reflecting infrared light. What is infrared light? It is a type of light that our eyes cannot see. This light can travel through clouds of cosmic dust that block normal light. So, Webb can see inside stellar nurseries where new planets are forming. It stays about 1.5 million kilometers from Earth and uses a big sunshield to stay cold so it can see the faint heat from distant objects. Now, let's talk about the star of our show, 3i slash Atlas. The I in its name stands for interstellar. This means it is not from our solar system. It started its journey around another star. It was somehow kicked out of its home. It has been traveling through the galaxy for millions, maybe even billions of years. Why are scientists so interested in an object like this? Because it is a piece of another world. Imagine you are an archaeologist. You can learn a lot by studying the tools and pottery left behind. In the same way, astronomers can learn about other star systems by studying the objects that come from them. 3i slash Atlas is a sample of the raw materials that build planets in another part of the galaxy. By studying what it is made of, we can see if other solar systems are built like ours. Before 3i slash Atlas, we had only seen two other interstellar objects, Oumuamua and 2i slash Borisov. 3i slash Atlas is the third confirmed interstellar visitor. The name comes from how it was found by the Atlas survey. The story of capturing this image is a tale of speed and precision. 3i slash Atlas was first detected by the Atlas survey telescopes in Hawaii in late 2024. At first, it looked like just another faint dot moving across the sky but astronomers quickly began to track its path. They used telescopes all over the world to watch it. As they gathered more data, they calculated its orbit. The numbers told an amazing story. The object was moving too fast to be trapped by our sun's gravity. Its path was a hyperbola, a shape that meant it came from interstellar space and was heading back out again. The chase was on. Once scientists knew 3i slash Atlas was an interstellar visitor, it became a top priority. But there was a problem. The object was very faint and moving quickly ground-based telescopes could only learn so much. A special request was sent to the team that runs Webb. Please, point the telescope at this visitor before it gets too far away. They switched the schedule and the team worked around the clock. So what did Webb see? Well, the image is honestly breathtaking. It's the clearest picture we've ever taken of an object from another star system. Unlike the previous visitor, 2i slash Borisov, which was really just a fuzzy blob, the web image of 3i slash Atlas shows incredible detail. We can see a solid object right at the center, the nucleus. This is the heart of the interstellar object. It appears irregular, a lumpy, cratered rock about a kilometer wide. Webb's infrared vision detected a faint cloud of gas and dust, a coma. That tells us the object is active. As it neared the sun, sunlight heated its surface. Frozen materials like water ice and other frozen gases turn directly into gas. Sublimation. Webb didn't just image it, it analyzed the coma's light. Spectroscopy. Initial results are stunning. They've confirmed water vapor, the first direct detection of water from another star system on an object like this. The data also hints at complex organic molecules. This first image is really just the beginning of the story. It's opened the door to so many new questions. Scientists are now working hard to analyze all the data Webb has collected. One of the biggest goals is to create a complete chemical inventory of 3i slash Atlas. They want to know every single type of molecule present in its coma. How much water does it have? Frozen carbon dioxide? Methane? 
Comparing amounts of these ices to our own comets will tell us if 3i slash Atlas formed in an environment similar to our suns. Another big question is about the object's origin. By studying its trajectory, astronomers can try to trace it back through the galaxy and identify a potential home star. This is really difficult, like finding the single tree a leaf fell from in a giant forest. But if they can find its home star, it would be an incredible breakthrough. Scientists also want to study the physical properties of the nucleus. How fast is it spinning? What is its exact shape? Are there different surface textures and colors? Answers about spin and surface can tell us about its history, collisions, heating during its journey, and help build a biography for this interstellar traveler. This discovery is honestly more than just a scientific curiosity. It changes our perspective. Objects are constantly moving between star systems, carrying materials across the galaxy. Our solar system is not an isolated island. It's part of a vast cosmic ocean. Travelers bring materials and information. Knowing that pieces of other worlds visit us makes the universe feel more alive. It opens up a whole new field of study, interstellar archaeology. The confirmation of water and organic molecules on 3i slash Atlas has profound implications. It suggests the raw materials for life might be common across the Milky Way. This doesn't mean life itself is common, but many planets may have had the same starting materials as Earth, raising the chances similar chemistry led to biology elsewhere. We might one day send probes to intercept these visitors and bring back samples to study in our labs. Discoveries like this inspire young people, fuel new technology, and remind us what humanity can achieve when we work together. The story of 3i slash Atlas is far from over. As we speak, the object is continuing its journey, heading away from our sun and back into interstellar space. It will never return. We were honestly lucky to be here, with our golden eye in the sky ready to witness its brief passage. The data web collected will be studied for years. New papers will be written and our understanding will grow deeper. This discovery marks a new era for web. It has proven capable of studying faint, fast-moving objects as well as the oldest galaxies. Astronomers will now be on high alert for the next interstellar visitor. When 4i, 5i, and all the others are found, Webb will be ready. Each new object will be another data point. We will compare them and start to see patterns about the diversity of planetary systems. Our journey of discovery is a marathon, not a sprint. We are explorers by nature, and the cosmos is our final, endless frontier. The universe is speaking to us, and thanks to the James Webb Space Telescope, we are finally beginning to understand what it is saying. Our cosmic journey continues. So the next time you look up at the night sky, remember 3i slash Atlas. Remember that we live in a dynamic and connected cosmos. Remember that there are messengers from other stars flying through the darkness, carrying the secrets of their birthplaces. And remember that we have an eye in the sky, a magnificent golden telescope that is watching and learning on our behalf. The universe is speaking to us. And thanks to JWSET, we are finally beginning to understand what it is saying. Our cosmic journey continues.